Hello kids, welcome to today's maths class and today we'll do time. Let's revisit. In the jungle, there is a banana eating competition being held. Bintu and Balu are taking part in the competition. So are their friends, Biju and Bolu, Bertie and Boku. Each monkey has been given a bunch of 20 bananas. The competition starts exactly at 12 o'clock. Look at the finishing time for the monkeys and answer the question given below in the picture. So, the competition starts exactly at 12 o'clock. So, who has finished this first? Who won the competition? Jisne bhi jaldi finish kiya, he'll win the competition. So, here, look at this clock. The balloons. The time is 12 20 so he is the winner of this competition because he has finished all the bananas in 20 minutes next telling time most clock and watches have an hour hand and a minute hand so this is a clock it has two hands the small hand that is of hour hand and the big hand that is of minute hand. 60 second, there is one more hand that is second hand. Clear? So 60 second that is equals to one minute. That means the second hand in one minute complete the complete round of the clock. So 60 second that is equals to 1 minute, 60 minute that is equals to 1 hour. Means in 1 hour the minute had complete a round of clock. 24 hour that is equals to 1 day in hours. Here in this clock the hour hand is on 5 here and the minute hand is on 12. So, we'll say the time in the clock is 5 o'clock. So, we can write like this or we can write like 5 o'clock. Here in this clock. In half hours, the hour hand is between 3 and 4. Clear? And the minute hand is on 6. So, we'll say the time is... 3.30 or half past. Half past means 30 minutes ho gaye. So, half past 3. Clear? Here in this clock, in quarter past. The hour hand is between 7 and 8 and the minute hand is on 3. 3 means 15 minutes. So, one quarter is of 15 minutes. Clear? So, we'll say the time is 7.15. Or quarter past. Past means ho chuke. Quarter past seven. Clear? Here. In quarter two. Here. The hour hand is between two and three. And near to three. And the minute hand is on nine. So, I'll read the time as. It's still not three o'clock. So, I'll read the time as 2.45. Or quarter to 3 means still there 15 minutes left to 3 o'clock. So, we'll read quarter to 3. Clear? Next, practice corner 9.1. Draw hand on the clock to show the time written below. So, here the time is 1 o'clock. That means the hour hand should be on 1. And the minute hand should be on 12. So here the time is 1 o'clock. So according to given time, you have to draw hands in the clock. Next is social emotional learning. Bolu the frog has forgot some facts about time. Help him fill in the blanks. So here some clues are given here. A clock has dash hand. A clock has two hands. The dash hand is the R hand. 
आर हैंड कौन सा होता है द स्मॉल हैंड क्लियर राइट हेयर टू और लाइक दिस यू कैन राइट सो द आर हैंड इज स्मॉल हैंड ऑफ द क्लॉक क्लियर नेक्स्ट टेलिंग टाइम टू द नियरेस्ट फाइव मिनट्स the minute hand move from one digit to the next in 5 minute means one digit se next digit move hone mein total time jo lagta hai that is of 5 minute in minutes hand when the minute hand is at one it show 5 minute past the hours when the minute hand is at two it shows 10 minute past and so on like 5 10 15 20 like this clear so here look at this clock one pe hoga that means 5 minute 2 5 into 2 10 3 5 2 3 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 55 and 60 clear left hand of the clock says number of minute to the next hour like this side here the time this is the right side this will read the time past the next hour clear here the minute to the next hour means next hour hone mein kitne minute bache hain that the left side will tell clear next we can read the time in two ways like here the small hand is between 1 and 2 and the big hand is on 5 that is 25 minutes and the time is 125 or we can read it as 25 past 1 clear like here the small hand is on 4 and the big hand is on 1 that means we will read the time as 4 5 or 5 minute past 4 like this we'll read the time next life skills the students of abc world schools are putting on a special evening they make up a program of different event so here some programs are given and their timing is given which event start at half past 5 half past 5 means 5:30 clear so cow singing cow singing will start at 5:30 clear next is practice corner 9.2 write the time in two ways here in clock the small hand is between 6 and 7 and the big hand is on 2 2 means 10 minutes so we'll write the time 6 10 or we can write 10 minute past Six. So, like this, we can write the time in two ways. Next is AM or PM. Each day has twenty-four hours, so the hour hand goes around the clock twice a day. A day end at twelve midnight, and the new day begin at the same time. So, in a day there are twenty-four hours. So, एक दिन में जो hour hand है that go complete two rounds of the clock because ek bar mein 12 hours and again it's 12 hours so two time it will go around the clock so here the time between 12 midnight to 12 noon means the new day start at 12 midnight so time between 12 midnight to 12 noon known as am and the time between 12 noon to 12 midnight known as pm so 7 o'clock in the morning we'll read 7 a.m. 7 a.m. means we are talking about the 7 o'clock in the morning clear here 11 o'clock in the night night so we'll write it 11 p.m. p.m. means we are talking about 11 o'clock the night next remember there is no am or pm written with the 12 o'clock it is 12 o'clock noon or 12 o'clock midnight 
clear next practice corner 9.3 Rewrite the time using AM and PM for following. 6 o'clock morning. So 6 o'clock morning, we'll write it as 6 a.m. Means we are talking about 6 o'clock morning. Clear? Next is estimating time. It takes a second to blink your eyes. It take about a minute to fill a glass with water. It take a little more than the hour to play a hockey match. Clear? Next, try this. Throw a ball into the air. How many times can you clap before you catch the ball? So try this, just throw the ball in the air and try to clap between that time before you catch the ball. So count how many times you can clap. Clear? Next is problem solving skills. Fill in the blanks, choose from the box. You will have to use some of the words more than once. How long it will take for? Rise to grow from seeds. So it will take months. So here some clues are given and you have to fill them. Clear? Next is conversion hour and minute. The two boys, one is saying I play for 180 minute daily. Another boy is saying I play for 3 hour daily. Can you tell me who play more? Well, both play for the same time daily. But how? Let us see. We know that 1 hour equals to 60 minutes. So 3 hour equals to 3 into 60 that is equals to 180 minutes. So both are spending same time in playing 3 hours or 180 minutes. Let us take few examples to understand the conversion of minute and hours. How many minutes are there in 6 hours? So as we know in 1 hour there are 60 minutes. So in 6 hours 6 into 60 that is 360 minutes. So this way we can find out how many minutes are there in a hour. Clear? Next is practice corner 9.4. Convert into minute, 8 hours into minute. So as we know there are 60 minutes in hour. So in 8 hour, 60 into 8. That is 480 minutes. So total 480 minutes in 8 hours. Clear? So you have to practice all the questions of this exercise. Next is calendar. A calendar help us to know the days and a month of the year. So it is also the tool to tell time. Facts about calendar. A year has 12 months. Each month is divided into weeks. One year me kitna hota hai? Total 12 month. And the month is divided into weeks. A week has 7 days. Week me kitna hota hai? Total 7 days. A month has 4 weeks and few more days. Every month me total 4 weeks hota hai aur usse thode din zada ho sakte hai. Every 4 year is a leap year. For example, 2004, 2008, 2012. So after every four year, the leap year will come. The leap year has 366 days. In the leap year, the February has 29 days. If a year can be divisible by four, that means it is a leap year. You can see the most month have 30 or 31 days. February has 28 or 29 days. So here is method by which you can find out how many days are there in that particular month. So, make a face, these are knuckles. So, on the upside, 31 days and the down, there are 30 days. Start from January, up, so 31, then down, it comes February. February is exception. It could be of 28 or 29 days, clear? So, then March, 31, April, 30 may 31 then june 30 
July 31, August 31, September 30, October 31, November 30, December 31. Clear? So, this way you can count how many days are there in that particular month. Clear? Next is practice corner 9.5. Look at the calendar of present year and answer the following question. This is year 2024. So, in 2024, August month has four Mondays. Clear? So, you can check the calendar and find out how many Mondays are there in the month of August. Next is calendar conversion. Revise your calendar fact and get ready for conversion. Month into days. We convert month into days by multiplying with 28 for February and with 30 or 31 as each month has different number of days. Integral we take 30. So generally, we take 30 days. Lete for example, convert the following into days, 3 months. So generally, we will take there are 30 days in a month. So total 90 days. So this way, we can find out how many days are there in given months. Next is weeks into days. To convert weeks into days, we multiply by 7 because there are 7 days in a week. If there are days, we add them to answer them. Convert the following into days. A fortnight. A fortnight has 15 days. Fortnight means 15 days. Clear? Here. 3 weeks and 5 days. So, we have to convert into days. So, in 3 weeks, 3 into 7 days plus 5 days. 21 plus 5, so total will 26 days. Next is days into hours. To convert days into hours, we multiply by 24. We will take an example, convert the following to hours, 5 days, 3 hours. So, as we know, there are 24 hours in a day. So, in 5 days, 5 into 24 hours plus 3 hours. Total 123 hours. Clear? In an hour, there are 60 minutes. In one day, there are 24 hours. One hour mein kitne hote? 60 minutes. And one day mein 24 hours. In a week, there are 7 days. Ek week mein kitne hote hai? 7 days. A year has 365 days. A leap year has 366 days. Because in leap year, February is of 29 days. So, ek day bar jata hai. So, total 366 days. Next is practice corner 9.6. Convert into days. How many days are in 9 months? As we know in 1 month, there are 30 days. So, 9 month, 30 into 9. Total 270 days. Clear? So, you have to practice all the questions of this exercise. Next is group activity in collaboration. Write the date of present month and then fill in the blanks below. So, here you have to write the name of month, the year, the first Monday of the month is on. So, you have to write the month and year and accordingly you will fill the detail and answer the following question. Clear? So, this activity you have to do by yourself. Next is multiple choice questions. Take the correct option. The time between noon and the midnight is called noon to midnight is called PM, post meridian. So, A is the correct answer. Clear? So, here we end the chapter. I hope you understand it well. Now, you have to practice it.